Well, here we are, part three of Super Fun Adventure Corny Times with Ra. Uh, you guys asked for it, so here we go. Uh, basically, it's not looking too good. I, kn I know I start most videos like this, but it, it generally isn't looking too good. We have way too many cornfields for the people we have. People are broken. Uh, we have all the corn spread out everywhere. And it's, it's just generally not looking good. It's an it's a unorganized mess, so... First order of duty, we'll be sorting this out, and hopefully in about, I don't know, a couple of months' time, it'll be all looking nice and spotless. Well, we've done a few changes to the base. It's been a little bit more tidy. We got rid of all the blood lying around. Uh, we, we, we stopped growing those cornfields up there for the sake of uh, cutting down. We got a couple more slaves joined, but then we got this siege. This fight's been pretty dire at the moment. We've just been throwing bullets at each other and consistently missing. I mean, I tagged a couple of them, but... <laughs> That's about it. So after pulling my pe troops back after Sai got shot, and uh, yeah, not really a lot happening, I've noticed their mortars don't actually work. Thank God for combat extended not being very compatible with everything. Oh, don't worry, Randy just made up for it by shoving a poison ship right in the middle of a cornfield. <laughs> what? He's so kind. Ah, some of them have died from heat stroke, and some of them have also died from infection from their gunshot wounds. <laughs> Welcome to the cornfields, motherfucker. Oh, here they come. They're actually coming for an assault now, rather than uh, just sitting there not firing their turrets at me. No, <laughs> my cornfields. Oh, it's so mean. Yeah, he's, he's done. He's done. And let's get that one. There we go. Finally, they're pulling back. Jesus. Right, okay, so I'm rescued Davison. Alright. Silent. <laughs> they're, they're running. They're running. <laughs> you don't need to keep shooting them. Right, here we go. I've decided that the animals are going to be used for this fight because I know this one's going to be difficult. So here we go. Oh, God. Two large boys. Yeah, let's get the bazooka up. Okay, there's only one left. Oh, no! Man down! We got a man down! The guy with the M, he's down. Ah! God, he's clearing out the one with the heavy blaster. Oh, he's lost his senses. Alright, we got time. I'm try and fight that thing. There we go. Oh, boy. Another successful... Successful defense. <laughs> Rip. So, yeah. Uh, I've dug two more graves. Or digging two more graves. And we lost all our animals. But we're still alive. So I'm not going to lie, I haven't played this for about a week because I've been massively ill. And I'm not going to lie, it's not looking very good. I didn't really leave it in a very good state, but I'm sure we can uh, fix this. Uh, yeah, as you can see here, we've tried to centralize all our corn into one massive freezer rather than having it spread out across the entire base. But, uh, oh, oh, really? Another siege? They seem to be running one by one at me. Oh, he's dead. Ah, they're leaving. I think they stole, yeah, they stole Pinky, but, ah, uh, well. Hey, a fairly decent Wanderer just joined. That's actually going to be, like, super helpful for a change. See, I thought he was really good, and then I realised he was 97, frail, has asthma, has a heart defect, and chronic kidney disease. Oh, and an artificial nose. So, not very helpful. So, I've put the old man to good work. He's now making me drugs. God oh, damn it, man, he's sending another raid at me. I'm not actually prepared for this one. Yeah, this seems to be going quite easy, actually. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, that was, uh, that was far easier than I thought that was going to be. Oh, dear. That's a big raid. Uh-oh. They all kind of just came for it once. Oh, there we go. Oh, that was pretty easy. Pretty easy in the end. Nothing, nothing to worry about. I swear all this game has been so far is just raid after raid after raid. I, I haven't really achieved anything. No! Randy bloody gave me a solar flare and so my cord started to deteriorate because I've had it for so long now. No! <laughs> oh boy, that's slightly terrifying. Rip traders? Question mark? Oh god, that guy's just broke grenades. <laughs> oh, not again. Another infestation. How many? Oh. Oh god. Oh. <laughs> Problem is, I don't actually know where the napalm blaster is. I think I might have accidentally got rid of it. Which might cause a few problems, because that was my only way of dealing with all these bugs. Look at them all! 
it's all right. We're adults. We're just going to hide behind our walls and lock the doors and pretend everything's okay. I don't know where these bugs are going, but it's okay. They just keep getting shot down by my turrets. Converting corn to jelly. Like hell you are. Yeah, that's what I thought. You... You, you flee. Well, Randy always loves his extremes. Instead of sending me someone who's extremely old, they sent me someone who's extremely young. So we now have a young 15-year-old in my car. Oh, oh wow. Here, here we go. Here comes another massive raid. Oh, Jesus. Here we go. Well, that was pretty intense. There's a lot of dead bodies lying around now, but uh, we're, 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 we're still alive. Thanks to Randy now, five out of my six colonists now all have the flu. I feel like we're going to have a few more casualties. Well, there's our first death from the flu. <laughs> Rip. Yeah. Okay, I think this person's about to die. Yep, there you go. <laughs> there's two more dead people. We're back down to three people. Oh, yay. Gosh, how bad things are going here. Bloody cats are becoming alcoholics now. I, I have just noticed nearly all my cats are drunk. <laughs> it's like... what. Well, What's going on here? <laughs> huh, once again, Randy has sent a uh, poison ship down into my uh, cornfields. Here we go, we have the ultimate team of alcoholic cats, a cripple, old men, and an elephant to take on mechs. What better team could you think of? Oh god, here we go, oh, a couple of big boys here. A couple of big boys and a couple of sides, but the cats are getting right in there. I mean, well, and the elephant. Oh, the elephant's knocking them down, here we go. Oh, we, we, we lost, we got a man down. Oh, God, that centipede's just going to clear my house. Oh, Sai, come on, run away. <laughs> we can't fight them. Come on. We should hopefully kill the little ones down here. Aha. Aha, hit him whilst he's reloading. If we can hopefully kill his sensor, then we'll be in a really good place. But, uh, that's just... Killing at the center is the problem. I'm not quite sure what he's shooting at at the moment, but we're, uh, it's okay. Haha! -ha. Both his sensors are gone. He's useless. Just to pick him off now. Oh yeah, you're enjoying that, aren't you? I need to just die. Hurry up and die! <laughs> no, not Sai. I'm in the neck. Okay, that's that one down. Let's just go kill this Lancer and finish this off. <laughs> well, the man in black has arrived, but I, I don't think it's gonna. I don't think this is gonna go very well. Ha <laughs> ha! Another successful defense. <laughs> We didn't have too many casualties. I'm sure we can start again with just one man in black. Everything's going to be okay. Oops, might have forgotten I had a prisoner. Uh, now they've got extreme starvation, but ah, it's fine. If only I had a bigger gun right now, things would be so much better. Oh, he's shooting a musket at me. Now we just sit here and shoot them all as they run. That's really annoying. I didn't know that her daughter was trying to kill her as well. So, in that gunfight, I killed her daughter and now she's upset that the daughter that was trying to kill her is dead. Right? Well, this is tragic. She can't fight back because she's incapable of combat and the other guy's on a sad wonder. <laughs> so, <laughs> for God's sake. <laughs> Why is this game being so horrible to this me? This is actually how she's going to die. This is... I can't, I can't get away. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually one of those moments where I genuinely hate this game. <laughs> here we go, he's gonna go attack the other guy. What's gonna happen here? No. No, is he not gonna fight back? No! This is generally getting depressing now watching this. Oh, finally, he's actually decided to attack back. Oh, brilliant. Not that he's been bitten multiple times and his bloody friend is dying. Thanks. It's so kind. I've just given up burying our dead. I'm just going to burn them. It's just going to be easier. Here we go. Here's another siege. Well, it's a good thing the turrets still don't work, so I can just sit here and snipe them whilst they're uh, 
trying to shoot me with nothing. I was kind of hoping the infestation would do something, but hasn't. So an insect bug just ran in and uh, someone shot their shells and blew them up. So they're now they're deciding to come and attack me now after, you know, they seem to just completely did something retarded, which is fine. I'm okay with that. Well, that was pretty easy. And now we just sit here for about 10 minutes whilst our only person we have is currently broken. So I had a transport crash and I thought, ah, oh, that's great, we can recruit this guy. And then I realized my guy has the social skills of a wet flannel. So this is going to take a while. Haha, <laughs> we just bought all the slaves, sold all our drugs, sold all our ammo and all the other stuff. We are ready. We are so ready for the rebirth of this colony. The 200,000 corn dream is still there. It's still there. Another infestation? Oh, really? Oh, oh, God. <laughs> Things are looking up. We've got some garden tea scent, a psychic soothe, and everyone is super happy. Yay! Oh boy, here comes a federation raid. I'm hoping they're just going to run straight into that infestation and we won't have to deal with it. That's what all these infestations are. They're just tactical defenses. Haha, <laughs> just as I planned. Ah, uh, I could just sit here and watch this all day. This is brilliant. This is two birds, one stone situation right here. So, I sold a load of guns to this trader and he must have fallen over because it said uh, taking wounded trader home. It then dropped all the guns and stuff I sold him. Well, it's been like a month or two, and uh, things are generally going really well. We are actually starting to make more corn than we're using. So now it's just the slow drag of uh, moving up in the world. So I just paused the game, and uh, I feel like we're about to have a bad time. So let's experience this together. Okay, actually, that wasn't too bad. Oh, no, it's Attack of the Noodles. Okay, I am not going to lie. I, I really can't be bothered to sit through the rest of this because everything's going well now to a degree. And we've just got to basically just wait for corn to go up. And I was going to go to 200,000, but I don't really see much point in that. So, yeah, instead of wasting everyone's time, I'm just going to cut the video here and uh, just say the usual. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, all that rubbish, and uh, see you. See you in the next video. <laughs>